Hugh Jackman tells Prince Harry not to climb the stage as he attempts to join Ryan Reynolds and Sean Levy during an interview about their film Deadpool and Wolverine. What was meant to be a routine discussion about the highly anticipated Deadpool and Wolverine crossover quickly took an unexpected turn when a certain royal guest decided to get hands-on. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for updates. The scene unfolded during a joint interview with stars Hugh Jackman, Ryan Reynolds, and director Sean Levy. The trio was comfortably seated on stage, discussing the challenges and excitement of bringing these iconic Marvel characters together on the big screen. Suddenly, movement to the side caught their attention. Making his way towards the stage was none other than Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, with a mischievous grin on his face. The royal seemed intent on crashing the party. What's happening? Jackman exclaimed, his eyes widening as he watched the prince approach. Don't you dare, he warned, holding up a hand in a futile attempt to stop the determined royal. But Prince Harry was not to be deterred. With a nimble hop, he hoisted himself onto the stage, drawing gasps from the audience. Reynolds and Levy looked on with a mixture of amusement and bewilderment, unsure how to proceed. Jackman, ever the consummate professional, quickly took charge of the situation. Harry, get off the stage, he commanded. His voice a blend of sternness and good-natured exasperation. The prince, undeterred, grinned and continued his march towards the three men. I just want to join in the fun, he said, his eyes sparkling with excitement. Reynolds, always the quick-witted jokester, couldn't resist adding his touch of humor to the situation. Harry, mate, I know you're used to storming the stage, but this one's ours, he quipped, earning a round of laughter from the audience. Levy, sensing the need to defuse the tension, stepped in. Come on, Harry, let's keep this interview PG, shall we? He said, gesturing for the prince to step back. But Prince Harry was not about to be deterred so easily. With a mischievous glint in his eye, he turned to Jackman and said, You know, I've always wanted to try my hand at Wolverine. Maybe we could swap roles for a bit? The audience erupted in laughter, their amusement palpable as they watched the royal try to insert himself into the interview. Jackman, ever the consummate professional, couldn't help but chuckle at the absurdity of the situation. Sorry, but this Wolverine gig is all mine, Jackman replied his tone playful but firm. How about you go find your own superhero role? The prince, undeterred, continued to edge closer to the trio, his eyes sparkling with mischief. Come on, you guys, just give me a chance, he pleaded, his voice dripping with feigned innocence. Reynolds, always the quick-witted jokester, couldn't resist adding his touch of humor to the situation. You know, Harry, I hear Prince Charming is looking for a new sidekick. Maybe that's more your speed, he quipped, earning another round of laughter from the audience. The banter continued with the three actors doing their best to keep the royal at bay while maintaining their composure. Jackman, in particular, seemed to relish the challenge, his quick wit and sharp timing on full display as he tried to corral the mischievous prince. In the end, it was Levy who managed to finally usher Prince Harry off the stage, gently but firmly guiding him back to his seat. The director, ever the diplomatic mediator, turned to the audience and said, Sorry, folks, but this interview is strictly for the professionals. Maybe we can arrange a special royal edition another time? The audience erupted in applause, their laughter and cheers echoing throughout the room. Jackman and Reynolds exchanged a knowing glance, their camaraderie and chemistry evident even in the midst of the chaos. As the interview wrapped up, the three men couldn't help but reflect on the unexpected turn of events. Well, that was certainly a first, Jackman chuckled, shaking his head in disbelief. Reynolds, always the quick-witted jokester, couldn't resist one last dig. I don't know, Harry. I think you might have a future in stunt work. Just leave the acting to the professionals. The audience erupted in laughter once more, their appreciation for the actor's quick-witted banter evident as the interview came to a close. The trio couldn't help but feel a sense of pride and accomplishment, having weathered the unexpected royal intrusion with their trademark humor and charm. It was a moment that would no doubt go down in the annals of celebrity interviews, a testament to the enduring appeal of these three Hollywood heavyweights and the unpredictable nature of the entertainment industry. And who knows, 
Maybe one day Prince Harry will get his chance to don the claws and join the Deadpool and Wolverine team. But for now, he'll have to be content with being the royal heckler in the audience.